those of us in southwest and central Virginia know all too well that fall not only brings colorful leaves, but also an increased risk for hitting a deer. 10 News anchor Brittany McGraw has a look at how to avoid a crash in the first place. Now that there are fewer hours of daylight, it's harder to see deer in the roads. That's one of the reasons why deer strikes spike in the fall. One study estimated more than 1.9 million animal collision insurance claims in a recent one year period, and another found the average claim for animal strikes was $2,730. To avoid hitting a deer, first slow down, especially around dawn or dusk when the deer are most active. And use your high beams as often as you can to make sure you're seeing further down the road. Deer tend to travel in groups, so if you see one run across the road, expect more. If a deer runs out in front of you, you do not want to swerve. That can put you at risk for hitting another vehicle or losing control of your car. Instead, Consumer Reports recommends you slow down as quickly and safely as you can. In most cases, you're more likely to survive a deer strike than a crash with another car. Sadly, if you do hit a deer, pull over to a safe spot on the side of the road and call the police and animal control. Get out of the car, but don't ever approach the animal, but take pictures of the scene for your insurance company. Brittany McGraw, 10 News, working for you.